Hello and welcome to Site Management by 6U. Today we're going to look at how to upload a PDF file and then link to that in a document by using the Site Administration. We are looking at the 6U Startup Special demo page here. And we're going to start by clicking on Manage Site Pages to make sure we're on a page where we can uh, edit the content for the site. I'm going to switch to this other tab just so you can get an idea. This is what the page looks like if you go to um, the various pages of our demo here, uh, contact us form. So today we're going to add a link here on the hosting page. So let's go back to site management and we'll look for the page hosting here. Go across to edit. That's going to open the page and uh, our editor here. Um, you'll see the content that, that is visible on that page. We're going to use the button here called insert edit embedded media. Uh, we also have this SM image manager which is used for pictures specifically. It's an upgrade from the standard image editor that's with media. So for files we'll use the embedded media button. Click on that. New window opens and it gives you a few different types of files if you want to upload a specific type of uh, media such as Flash, QuickTime, Shockwave, Windows Media, Real Media. We're not going to use any of those today, so we can just leave that as it was. We're going to use this file URL field here and click on the Browse button. That's going to open up your computer so you can look for the file you'd like. These are the current files that are listed. You'll see there are none there. Let's click on the Upload tab, and you're given this interface. Click on Browse, and this is where you can navigate on your computer and decide what file you'd like. We're going to do this website design pricing. You can put in as many files as you'd like here and it will upload them all. We're just going to upload this one. Uh, it's recognized it as PDF and has the size. Let's click on Upload. And there you go. It gives you progress below and it'll show you that it's been uploaded here. Now we can go to Browse and you'll see that file is indeed uh, located on the web server now. Uh, you can also, if you want to edit it, you can go back to delete that file. You can select Delete and Delete Files if you needed to. Um, so, But right now that's all we needed to do, we just wanted to upload it with this interface. So we can go ahead and close that window, and we can close this window. Uh, let's go ahead and link to that document now. So here we have an area, set my cursor after that paragraph, and let's put a couple returns in, and we'll say uh, pricing document. Let's highlight that, and then we're going to click on the link button here. When we click on link, you'll then see um, the properties of that link. And let's click on the browse button here for the URL we want. And you'll see in this list, here we are, 6U Website Design Pricing is a document we just uploaded. And we'll click on that. And let's go ahead and have that open in a new window. That's the target. The rest of the uh, fields we can just leave blank. Click on insert. And you'll see there it went ahead and added a link. We'll go ahead and update this. So that's updating that page to the database. And let's go back to our website hosting page and refresh. And you'll see the pricing document link has been added. And when we click on that, a new browser opens with the PDF for 6 pricing. So that's all that's needed in order to upload a file and then add a link to it.